Welcome to the module on data cleaning and pre-processing. In this module, we'll focus on preparing raw data for analysis. Cleaning and pre-processing are essential steps in any data analysis project as they ensure the data is accurate, consistent, and ready for meaningful insights. First, let us talk about importance of data cleaning and pre-processing, which we are going to cover extensively in this module. Uh, when it comes to raw data, it often contains errors, inconsistencies, and also missing information. Cleaning or cleansing and pre-processing help us in handling missing values, removing duplicates, standardizing formats and data types, also getting subset data based on conditions. Also, we should be able to organize data for easier interpretation. By the end of this module, you will have the tools to transform messy data into a clean and structured format which is ready for further analysis or visualization. Before getting into the lessons related to this module, let's briefly explore the dataset we will be using for this module. It is nothing but the Toyota sales dataset. It contains the following columns. Sale ID which is a unique identifier for each sale. Sale Rep ID, the ID of the sales representative responsible for the sale. Sale Date, the date of the sale. The Car Model which is nothing but the model of the car sold. Sale Amount, the monetary value of the sale or transaction amount. Commission Percentage or Commission underscore PCT, the Commission Percentage for the sales representative. Also Sale Status, the status of the sale such as completed, pending, cancelled, etc. By the end of this module, here is what you will learn. First, you will understand how to handle missing data using functions such as dot fill na and dot drop na. Also, you will learn how to identify and remove duplicate rows with functions such as dot duplicated and dot drop duplicates. We will also see how to rename columns and reorder them for clarity. You will also understand how to check and convert data types to ensure consistency. You will also go through the details about how to filter and sort data for specific use cases. Also, you will go through the details about how to use dot query, which is a function for SQL-like filtering of data. Each of these skills will be demonstrated with practical examples, primarily using Toyota sales dataset. To learn all these important concepts, this module is structured as follows. First, we'll start by checking for and handling missing data. Next, we'll identify and remove duplicate rows. Then we'll rename and reorder columns for better readability. We'll also ensure data types are consistent and convert them as needed. Finally, we'll filter and sort data to retrieve relevant subsets using both conditions and the dot query function. Dot query is a SQL-like function to filter the data. Now let's also talk about why uh, data cleaning and pre-processing matters. Cleaning and pre-processing ensure your data is reliable and structured which is critical for effective analysis. Whether you are analyzing sales trends, evaluating sales reps performance or making business decisions, clean data is the foundation for meaningful insights. Let's get started with the first lesson which is nothing but handling missing data. We will identify missing values in the Toyota sales dataset and learn how to address them effectively. See you there.